morning. Uh, we are so excited to have Pastor Guillermo and Pastor Audria uh, back with us. Uh, longtime partners here at Stillwater. We've had a partnership with them for years now. I think they've been coming for uh, at least seven years to Stillwater, sometimes a couple of times a year, at least once a year, coming to visit us. And uh, we've been sending teams and a number of folks here have gotten to go and spend time uh, worshiping and, and ministering alongside them in Cuba. In fact, there will be uh, several folks from Stillwater that are headed down there in January. And so we'll have some, some more folks there uh, very soon. If you're not familiar with uh, Cuban uh, Methodism, there's a... Uh, their church is on fire, and God has just uh, brought just a powerful revival in the Cuban church in the midst of uh, significant hardship in, uh, you know, a very difficult um, place as far as the economy and the ability to, to get food and goods. It's a very difficult place to live, and yet in the midst of that hardship, God has done an incredible work, and we're so grateful for their ministry at Havana Central and our ongoing uh, chance to get to be just a little part of what God is doing there. And so uh, this morning, you're going to get to hear from Pastor Guillermo, and I'll tell you, you should just stay for the second service because Pastor Audrey is going to share next service. You might as well just stay for both and hear them both because they're both be powerful uh, messages and different this morning. And we're also so grateful for Rebecca Clapp, uh, who is an ordained deacon and a dear member of our church family. And she helps to lead uh, this Cuban partnership and is the best translator I've ever met in my life. And so we're grateful to have her here this morning as well. All right, let's, uh, Pastor Guillermo and Rebecca, would you come and deliver God's word for us this morning? Thank you, Pastor. Thank you. El diablo puede falsificar muchas cosas. The devil can falsify a lot of things. Puede falsificar un mensaje. He can falsify a message. Puede falsificar una danza. He can falsify a dance. Puede presentarse de una manera oculta. He can uh, uh, present himself in a hidden way. Sin tú y yo conocerlo. Without you and I knowing it. Pero hay una cosa que el diablo nunca podrá falsificar. But there is some one thing that the devil can never falsify. Y es lo que yo siento aquí en esta mañana. And that is what I feel in this place right now. Es la presencia de Dios. It is the presence of God. La presencia de Dios nunca. The presence of God. Eso es lo que marca la diferencia. This is what, what makes the difference. Usted sabe si Dios está en un lugar. You can know if God is in a place. Solamente por medio de su presencia just through his presence. You can know if a ministry is anointed or not through the presence. How beautiful it is when the presence of God is there. And so I give thanks to God to be at Stillwater. For more than six years, more than six years I have known this place and this beautiful congregation. For more than six years, you have been receiving us you have been receiving the most beautiful most handsome pastor of all of Cuba <laughs> for, for six years me estoy quedando a dormir. I have been staying sleeping in a millionaire's house the most handsome man in all of the United Dr. States David Dr. David Watson <laughs> For six years, this church has maintained our church. Um, Christmas uh, dinners, um, food for children, clothing, shoes. Um, here there's somebody who goes to Cuba, y ella va a Cuba and when she goes to Cuba ella lo deja todo, ella lo she leaves todo. everything she just gives Sarah up everything Mayer. it's my friend Sarah Mar Sarah llega a Cuba. she just comes to Cuba y ella lo da todo por Cuba. and she brings everything to give to Cuba ella lo entrega todo. she gives everything over Gracias por su apoyo. So they, we're so grateful for your Gracias support por su, por su amor a and iglesia. your love for our church Cuba, Cuba está pasando por un momento of Cuba is going through a really horrible moment right now. We are living through uh, the um, greatest migration in the history of Cuba. There have never been 
so much migration me like cuenta, this. Me cuentan que el mes pasado. They tell me that last month. Solamente por la frontera sur de México. That only through uh, the Mexican, the southern Mexican border. Para entrar a Estados Unidos. To get into the United States. Inmigraron más de 30 mil cubanos. There were more than 30,000 Cubans who immigrated. Sin contar los que se van para Serbia y Montenegro. And that doesn't count those who go to pa, Serbia, Montenegro. Para España. Spain. Para Jamaica. Jamaica. Ningún cubano quiere estar en Cuba. No Cuban wants to be in Cuba Apagone right now. la corriente 48 horas sin corriente. Um, we'll, we'll go sometimes 48 hours without power. No hay comida. There's not food. Y cuando aparece la comida. And when the food appears. Aparece cinco veces más de lo que costaba antes. It, it, it's five times more expensive than what it cost before. Todo está muy difícil. Everything's really difficult. Es muy compleja la situación en Cuba. It's a really complicated situation in Cuba right now. Pero le damos gracias a Dios. But we give thanks to God que hay una presencia de Dios that poderosa there is a powerful Cuba. presence of God in hay una Cuba de Dios there is que a cubre glory of God la that covers the nation of Cuba Yo llevo 13 años de I have spent 13 years pastoring Central Havana Church el año 14. so I started uh, I'm about to start the 14th year it's probably I'm just aguantando. so handsome these people love me so much 14 <laughs> years with them Así mismo mi esposa lleva 18 años aguantándome. And, and my wife has 18 years putting up with me. Ah, ella, ella. <laughs> y en, en los años que llevo de pastor en Centro Habana. And so in the, the 13 years that I've pastored Havana nunca, Central Church. Nunca, habíamos tenido un ministerio. We have ministerio never, never had a ministry. Tan ungido. So anointed. Con tanto poder de Dios. With so much power of God. Como en este tiempo. As we do in this time. Lo que está sucediendo en la iglesia. What is happening in the poderoso. church right now is something powerful. Le voy a contar. And I'm going to tell you. Lo, lo, más o menos lo que vamos a hacer aquí hoy. Well, what, basically what we're going to do today en, here en iglesia, in our church el primer servicio, in the first service a las de la mañana, we start at 9 o'clock and the second service a las de la tarde. ends at 4 o'clock <laughs> <laughs> Eso es más o menos lo que va this a is about aquí. what we're going to do today <laughs> <laughs> el pastor Mac me dijo que podía predicar ahora hasta las 3 de la tarde. Pastor Matt just told me I could preach till 3 in the afternoon. <laughs> se free, se free. <laughs> oiga, be free, be oiga, free. y lo que Dios está haciendo so es listen, poderoso. What God is doing is se powerful. Se está sanando personas de cáncer. And he's healing people of cancer. Tumor desapareciendo. Uh, di tumors are disappearing. Personas estériles saliendo embarazadas. Um, people who have been who have had fertility problems are are, are getting pregnant. Llegando a Cuba. Um, getting to Cuba Queremos comprar una piscina. We, when we get back to Cuba we're gonna, we want to buy a, a una, pool una piscina bien grande. A, a big pool Porque las playas ahora son muy frías. because right now the beaches are really cold y por el momento, and right now tenemos 62 personas we have para, 72 para people ready to be baptized Pero, aleluya pero hoy, But today, mi, mi pastores asistentes, my uh, assistant pastors, me van a llamar, are going to call me, para darme una cifra exacta. To, to tell me an exact number porque, porque hay que, que, because there's que always no more people decir que no sería 62, sería más. so I want to say there's, there's not just going to be 72 there's going to be more people ready to quiero, get baptized quiero I want to tell you que en el mes de agosto, that in August David, en Cuba, da David was in Cuba con los hermanos de Arkansas, with some friends from Arkansas un con los niños en la calle. and we did an event with the children in the street más de mil niños en la calle. more than a thousand children in the street Mother, a niños. and we gave gifts to more than a thousand and, and food to more than a thousand children Lo que Dios está algo what God is doing is something impactful Entonces, esas cosas suceden, and so when these things happen it doesn't matter to somebody if there's food or not food it doesn't matter to somebody if there's a power or a not único, power The only thing that matters to somebody is that the glory of God is manifesting and that the power of God continues and in a powerful way when, wherever you are. Okay, now I'm going to preach. Mire, 
Listen, ya, antes de predicar, before una I cosa preach, más. one more thing. En el, en el verano, in the summer, tenemos tres campamentos. we have uh, three uh, camp events a nivel nacional. at the, the national level. Adolescente, for youth, jóvenes, or for um, adolescents, for young people, y jóvenes más adultos. and young adults. Se separa en tres. And so we separate them into three no, events. Normalmente, mi obispo es el único que va a predicar and normally, a my tres. bishop is the only one who preaches these three events. Este año me invitaron a mí But this year, they invited me a predicar también a los tres. to preach at these three events. Separaron una noche de avivamiento. And we separated a night of revival Donde yo tenía que orar por los jóvenes. where I had to go and I prayed for mi, the youth mi, las manos a todos. And, and lay hands on everybody. Me entregaban el pulpit, el cul me entregaban el micrófono a las nueve de la noche. And they gave me the microphone at nine o'clock at night. Usted sabe a qué hora yo terminaba. You know what time I, I finished? No se asuste. Don't, don't be scared. A las dos de la mañana. At two in the morning. Desde las nueve de la noche. From nine o'clock at night. Hasta las dos de la mañana. Until two in the morning. Mi obispo llegaba. My bishop arrived. Y me dice, mi hijo. And he said to me, son. Me dicen que a las dos de la noche. They told me you were preaching till two o'clock. Los jóvenes estaban en el piso revolcado. And that the, the young people were just on the floor. Eso es verdad. It's true. Cuando hay hambre. When there is hunger y hay sed de su and presencia, when there is thirst for God's presence, la gente es libre. people are freed. La gente es free. People are freed. Mientras más Dios le da uno, más uno quiere. When, the more God gives you, the more you want. Qué lindo. Amen. También mi esposa, and also my wife, mi es bella. my beautiful wife, Eso me tiene a mí <laughs> she, she has me asleep. Si usted ve que yo miro para allá, y, me there, y, me, y me quedo congelado por mi esposa. Mi esposa Dios la está usando con cánticos nuevos. My, God is using my wife with uh, giving her a lot of new music, music um, that she's composing new todo. music. También tenemos eh, hemos abierto nuevas iglesias. And we've opened new churches. Hijos espirituales en toda Cuba. And we have spiritual sons and daughters in Dios all of Cuba. Dios nos ha bendecido. God has blessed us Dios so much. Dios ha sido bueno. Bueno. And God has been good. Primer okay. libro de Pedro capítulo 1. The first Uh, the, from 1 Peter uh, chapter 1 versículo 10 y versículo 11 uh, verses 10 and 11 mi hermana lo tenía marcado y no nos habíamos puesto de acuerdo and so um, my sister already had this marked in her Bible and that's how I knew that God had us in agreement amen vamos okay vamos 1 Peter 1 verses 10 and 11 concerning this salvation The prophets who spoke of the grace that was to come to you searched intently and with the greatest care, trying to find out the time and circumstances to which the Spirit of Christ in them was pointing when he predicted the sufferings of Christ and the glories that would follow. Padre, gracias, Señor. Father, thank you. Abra tu pueblo en esta mañana. Open up your people en el this morning de Jesús. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. La vida del apóstol Pedro. The life of the Apostle Peter es una vida que a mí me gusta. is a life that I love. Es el que más me gusta de He todos is los my favorite disciple of all the disciples. Pedro es el que más entre todos. Because Peter is the one who overcomes the most. Según lo que cuenta la historia, según cuenta la historia, Pedro era un hombre de pocos estudios. And so I'll tell you a little of his story. He was a man of, of little uh, study. Un hombre de pocos estudios, de poco nivel cultural. And, and, and little cultural level. Pero era un hombre que amaba a Dios con toda su fuerza. But he was a man who loved God with all of his strength. Y lo más importante que podemos tener en esta vida. And the most important thing we can have in this life. Es el amar a Dios con toda nuestra fuerza. Is to love God with all of our strength. Hay cuatro momentos en la vida de Pedro. There are four moments in the life of Peter that I love. Porque Pedro era un apasionado por Jesús. Because Peter was passionate Pedro about Jesus. Pedro era un apasionado por su gloria. He was passionate about his glory. Por eso glory. aquí Pedro le está escribiendo. And so that is why Peter is writing here. A los judíos to the Jews que están esparcidos that are dis, uh, that are dispersed por por toda Asia throughout all of Asia. Por, por toda la Asia menor throughout all of Asia minor. Por el punto um Ponto, Cappadocia, Asia, and, uh, Bitinia, Pontus, Cappadocia, um, Asia, Bitinia, Asia, 
de tal manera and so in this way, que Pedro Peter era un hombre que portaba la gloria que portaba la unción que portaba la presencia the glory and the presence and the anointing. mi esposa sabe my, my wife knows que mis amigos en Cuba, that my friends in Cuba todos son amigos que, que aman a Dios, they're all friends who love God y, y, y que buscan su gloria. and they seek his glory a mí no me gusta andar con personas I don't like to spend time with people que su comentario o que su tema de conversación whose conversations or their comments no tenga que ver con las cosas de Dios don't have to do with the things of God y, y Pedro era un hombre and Peter was a man que estaba preparado who was prepared para honrar a Dios en todo momento to honor God in all moments hay cuatro momentos so there are four moments en la vida de Pedro in the life of Peter que a mí me gusta that I love el primer momento the first moment Jesús se acerca a los discípulos is when Jesus called the disciples together y, y le dice and said to them ¿Quién dice la gente que soy por ahí? Who, who do the people say that I am? Los discípulos comenzaron a decir and, and the disciples started to talk unos dicen que tú eres Elías otros dicen que tú eres el bautista oh, otros dicen que tú eres algún profeta que ha de venir somebody says that you're a prophet you're some, someone who's going to or come back ahora Jesús le dice ¿Qué ustedes piensan de mí? ¿Quién and dicen ustedes? And then Jesus says well what do you think I am? Who do you think I am? Y eso es muy importante and this is very important la opinión de las personas de afuera the, the opinion of outside people acerca del ministerio del pastor Mark de la pastora Jordan about y del the, pastor Mark um, the ministry of pastor Matt and pastor Jordan and pastor no está, Rob no es tan importante is not as important como la opinión que tienen ustedes que están al lado de ellos that you all have about their ministry el impacto mayor de ellos because the greatest impact of them siempre va a ser más a ustedes que a los de afuera to you all than to the people outside y ustedes outside. van a conocer más de ellos because you're going to know more of them Entonces, than people dice, Está bien. and so Jesus ya is like okay I know what people Ahora outside say about me but now I want to know what it is that mí. you say about me y Pedro se and, and P Peter stands y Pedro up le dice, Tú eres el and he says you are the Christ el hijo del Dios vivo. the son of the living Quiero God decir que Pedro and so this means that Peter había recibido una revelación had del received cielo. a revelation from Por heaven eso Jesús le dice a Pedro, and that's why Jesus says to Peter no tengo revelón ni carne ni sangre the, si no, this is not revealed cielo. by flesh and blood but by my father decir que Pedro era un hombre so Peter was a man que estaba conectado con Dios, who was connected to God que se con Dios. He, re he related to God because no, no one who's not connected to God no puede hablar los misterios de can, Dios. Can, 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 can talk about the no mysteries of God los secretos de Dios. Can, can know the secrets of God Entonces Pedro, and so Peter eh, sobresalió por encima de los demás um, uh, se fue, pues, salió por yeah, he, he, um, he, he became he was over everybody else y le dijo, Tú eres el because he said you, you are Eres the Christ you are the son of Segundo the living God que me gusta de Pedro. The, second, the second moment that I like in Peter's life is when he's next to Jesus es que los discípulos están en alta mar en la noche están en la mar en la noche uh, the disciples were in the, in the um, sea at night y de momento Jesús se le presenta. And, and all of a sudden Jesus presented himself. Los discípulos se asustan. And it scared the disciples. Oh, un fantasma. And they're like, oh, it's a ghost. Y de momento dice Jesús, no soy yo. And, and but Jesus said, no, it's me. Y qué fue lo que hizo Pedro? And what is it that Peter did? Pedro era loco. Peter was crazy. A mí me <laughs> a mí me encanta la I gente love, loca. I love crazy people. A mí no me gusta. <laughs> A mí no me gusta la gente que en la iglesia tú lo ves así. Yeah, I don't like the people at church that you look at and they're like this. No, a mí me gusta la no, gente I activa, like the la gente divertida. Ah. And fun people. Sí, a mí me gusta la gente que so siempre, I like siempre tú la ves trabajando para Dios. Siempre tú la ves emprendiendo cosas para Dios. Siempre tú la ves en el servicio de Dios. Siempre tú la ves hablando para Dios. A mí no me gusta la gente así. I, I don't like the people like this. <laughs> Peter was crazy. And, and he said, if it's you, tell me to come to you. And Jesus said, okay, come. And Peter launched down. And he started to walk no, no, on the water. No. Oh, okay. He started to walk. He started to walk on the water. Above the water. And to, to walk 
in the supernatural. Un acto de fe. An act of faith. Esto me encanta, amigos. I love Los actos this. De fe. The acts of faith. Un día el cocinero me dice. One day uh, the cook in our kitchen Pastor, at the church. La comida no da said to me pastor there's not enough food usted, los son 300 and, and listen um, on Sundays we, we give food to 300 people meals a ve, to 300 a veces people más, a veces más. sometimes more y a veces no hay comida. and sometimes there's not food usted tiene que dar lo que haya. and you just have to give what there is y le digo yo al cocinero, and so I said to the cook ponle la mano. let's put our hands y que se multiplique. on the food and pray that it multiplies Como los cinco pan y los dos peces. just like the five loaves and two fish y el cocinero me miró así. And, and the cook looked at me like this diciendo, el pastor es loco. and you're a crazy pastor no, el pastor no es loco. no your pastor's not crazy es que no hay más comida. it's there's not more Ponle food la mano y que so, se multiplique. so put your hands on it and pray that it multiplies oiga, oiga, y el cocinero oró. El cocinero oró y la comida sobró. And the, 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 cook, the cook did it and the, um, the food was enough. Me gusta, me, me gusta, gloria a Dios. Me gusta, me gusta la gente emprendedora. And so I love, I love the entrepreneurial people. La gente que no se queda quieta. The, the people who don't just Pedro, stay quiet. Pedro le dijo, eres tú, pues yo voy a ti. And Peter who says, well, if it's you, I'll, I'll come to you. Todo el mundo critica a Pedro porque se hundió. Oh, and the, the, whole, the whole world always criticizes Peter because he started to sink caminar, because when he started to walk on the water he stopped looking at Jesus Jesús, and you know when we stop to look at Jesus we, we, we drown Sin embargo, Nadie dice que Pedro fue el único que Therefore, caminó. you know, nobody ever talk, but nobody ever talks about how Peter was the only one me, that even tried to walk. Pedro. I love Peter. Porque Pedro marcaba la diferencia. Because Peter, Peter oh. ma, uh, marks a difference. Otro texto que me gusta más de Pedro. One other text that I love about Peter. Estamos en la introducción. Uh, we're in the introduction. <laughs> No me en el texto I, I haven't even entered in the text yet. Otro, otro, <laughs> otro que me gusta One Pedro. other uh, passage that I love about Peter es cuando Jesús le da comida a una multitud. is when Jesus gives food to a multitude. La gente empezaron a buscar a Jesús the people por, are, por los panes are, y por los peces. are starting to seek Jesus for, for uh, the bread and fish. Lastimosamente, hay personas que no buscan a Jesús porque lo aman, porque lo anhelan, Unfortunately, porque lo desean. there are people who seek Jesus hay personas que buscan who, a Jesús who, por seek, los beneficios who don't seek que Jesus de Jesús. because of love, but they seek Jesus for what they can get Eso from lo hay en Cuba, solo hay en This Unidos. happens in the U.S., Eso this happens in quiere. Cuba, this happens hay everywhere. Persona, hay persona there are que people no decía, who come to my church, en mi iglesia, yo le digo a los líderes, and I always say, I always say to my leaders uh, keep your eyes open there, there are people who come to church to fall in love with those girls there are people who come to church to, to seek a spouse there are people who come to church to, 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 to seek everything else except seeking God a ver que el pastor más vino vestido con una camisa azul muy elegante con unos tenis muy bonitos they come to see if Pastor Matt is dressed elegantly <laughs> <laughs> Hay personas que There no vienen a la iglesia. That come to church for y Jesús le dice, si ustedes quieren vayan y, de, y después la multitud viene encima de Jesús y Jesús le dijo, de cierto le digo que ustedes me siguen por los panes y por los peces. Ay, And so, you know, Jesus says there are people who um, that certainly follow me because of the fish and, and the loaves. But Jesus, and so there are people who follow Jesus just for the loaves and the fishes that he can multiply. And, and Jesus says, you know, if you want to, you, um, you can go with them. But Peter says, no, Lord, I, we will follow you. Because you are the only one who has the word of life. Otro, el último momento. And so the, the last, the last um, moment that I want to share about Peter. Al lado de Pedro about Peter es cuando Pedro lo niega. is when Peter denies Jesus tres cosas sucedieron. and three things happened Pedro siguió de lejos a Jesús Pedro siguió de lejos yeah de lejos. so Peter um, 
follow Jesus from a distance. Segundo cosa que sucedió. The second thing that happened. Pedro se sentó a conversar con quien no tenía que conversar. He sat down with people to converse with people he didn't need to talk to. Tercero lo negó. And the third thing that happened is that he neg uh, he denied Jesus. Pero me gusta Pedro. But I still love Peter. Porque después que lo negó. Because after he denied Jesus. Se arrepintió. He repented. Hay gente dentro de la iglesia. There are people within the church. Que no tienen la capacidad de arrepentirse. Who don't have the capacity to repent. Cuando cometen un error. When they mess up, when they make a mistake. Pero Pedro tuvo la capacidad but de arrepentirse. But Peter had the capacity to repent. Ahora bien, Pedro so le está listen, aquí right now, Peter is writing a esta gente to these people que necesitaban una palabra de Dios. that need a word from God. Y Pedro le escribe una and Peter verdad. writes to them a, a, a grand truth. Pedro se refiere primero al antiguo pacto. Um, he refers first to the ancient past. Y le dice a los profetas. And he, and he said the prophets. ¿Qué hicieron los profetas? What did the prophets do? Los profetas profetizaron. The prophets prophesied. Ahora déjeme explicarle quién eran los profetas. And so let me explain who were the prophets. Según la Biblia. According to the Bible. Los profetas. The prophets. Eran gente marcada, were, señalada. Were people who were chosen. Escogidas chosen Por Dios. for God by God Para traer una palabra to de bring a word of revelation pueblo. to his people Los profetas the prophets eran hombres were men Los cuales no era, la Biblia dice, no eran dignos de recibir were, were men who were not even worthy to receive eran hombres santo. they were they were men um, holy Hombres men, y mujeres que pasaron por esta tierra con una asignación. That, that passed through this, this world like a sign. Ahora me encanta Pedro. So I love Peter porque here. Porque dice los profetas que profetizaron de la gracia destinada a nosotros. He said the prophets who prophesied about the grace. De tal manera que en el Antiguo Testamento just like in the Old Testament había un solo mensaje there was only one en el Antiguo message. Testamento the Old había Testament había un solo anuncio there was just one announcement en el Antiguo Testamento there was just in había the, una sola visión there was just one vision in the Old Testament en el Testament. Antiguo Testamento in the Old Testament se gritaba una sola cosa voz se hablaba una sola cosa. They, there was only one thing they talked about, only one voice. The prophets prophesied. 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 What does it mean to prophesy? Prophesy means to speak acerca de algo about something que está por suceder, that is going to happen, que está por acontecer, that is going to be revealed. De tal manera que Pedro está hablando and so this is what Peter's talking de que about. Existieron hombres that these men que se encargaron de, de hablar acerca del futuro, that were, were called to talk about the future that it was their job to tell about things that were going to happen what, what kind of man can do futuro, this can talk about presente. something in the future while they're so, in the present only a man or a woman of God who loves God who receives a revelation from God so can only say what's going to happen in the future while they're in the present and what was the message of the prophets that the prophets prophesied about the grace hay una palabra en el hebreo que se llama el querisma el there, querisma there is a querisma. word in, in Hebrew the charisma el carisma. querisma que significa el querisma el mensaje el, de los oh, profetas oh a querigma el mensaje, uh, there is el a querisma. word in Hebrew charisma that, el mensaje de los profetas that el mensaje de los antiguos that is the message of the ancient prophets es el mensaje que también tenemos que hablar nosotros en la actualidad it is the same message that we have to speak in our the message of the prophets it was, it was the message that was for people um, yesterday, today, and tomorrow. ¿Cuál era el mensaje? What was the message? Cristo es el Señor. That Christ is the Lord. Y Cristo viene pronto. And Christ is coming soon. Hallelujah. No hay otro mensaje. There is no other message. No hay otra palabra. There is no other word. Que pueda predicar la iglesia en la tierra. That the church can preach in the earth. Ese es el mayor mensaje. This is the greatest message. Ese es, y si fuera en el béisbol, if ese es el baseball, gran slam. That's the grand slam. Ese es el gran slam. Cristo is, es el Señor. Christ is the Lord. Y Cristo and viene he pronto. is coming soon. No hay otro mensaje. There is no other message.
message. No hay otro. There is no other message. Cristo es el Señor. Christ is the Lord. Y Cristo viene pronto. And Christ is coming soon. Isaías lo profetizó. Isaiah prophesied. Isaías dijo. He said. ¿Por qué aquí? La Virgen concebirá y dará a luz un hijo. Will conceive a son. Y llamará su nombre Emmanuel. And he will be called Emmanuel. Que significa that means Dios con God nosotros. With us. Micah lo dijo. And Micah said, He's aquí Jerusalén. Um, uh, here I am, Jerusalem. Tu rey viene montado en un pollino. Your king is coming, Los mounted lo on a donkey. Y la iglesia, the prophets, y la iglesia lo sigue predicando. The the Cristo the grace, viene. And we continue prophesying. So we continue preaching Cristo this Christ is coming Christ todo, is coming es que cuando él venga yo no me quedo tú no and te quedas no vamos con él is that when he's coming you and I aren't staying we're going with him que lindo ay que lindo eso es navidad quiero que en navidad this, this is Christmas what Cristo is Christmas entre nosotros. is that Christ is Cristo entre nosotros. with us and among us y lo pre ese era el mensaje de los antiguos This was the message of the ancient Dice que ones. De la they, they spoke about the grace. ¿Qué lo que es What is grace? Me el tema de la I love the theme of grace. Si fuera a hacer una tesis en un seminario, If I was going to write a thesis in a seminary, la hiciera con la palabra gracia. I would do it on the word grace. Gracia. Grace. Es que Dios nos dé aquello. Is that, that God gives it. Que tú y yo no merecemos gives us something that we don't deserve por la condición en la que tú y yo nos encontramos. because in the condition we find ourselves in y por nuestra carencia total de méritos. and, and wait, y por nuestra carencia total de ¿cómo se dice mérito? Y, ¿cómo pudieron decir mérito? Y por oh, carencia and, total and, for, de and, and by our own talents Tenio. and our own abilities Gracia grace es el todo por nada is receiving everything for nothing Para que no nada. for those who deserve nothing Gracia. grace en el diccionario. in the dictionary el favor is, is um, uh, I, I'm unmerited favor. Y el sinónimo que más se parece a favor inmerecido. And the synonym that that is most like um, unmerited favor. Es regalo no merecido. Is an undeserved gift. Entienda esto. You, you understand this? Lo, cada vez que se levantaba un profeta. Every time that a prophet got up. Tú sabes lo que el profeta decía. You know what the prophet was saying? Stillwater. Stillwater. Viene un regalo. A gift is coming. Que tú no te mereces. That you don't deserve. Pero aún sin merecerlo. But even though you don't deserve it. Dios lo va a enviar. God is going to send it. Wow. Wow. Tú, tú no has hecho nada. You haven't done anything. Para recibirlo. To receive this. Tú no estás en condiciones are de not recibirlo. in a condition to receive Pero this. Así, But even though, even so, God is going to send it. Eso se llama this is grace. Es todo lo contrario. It is the total contrary a la de gracia. Of, a of, la de disgrace, el of mundo, disgrace. El mundo anda en desgracia. Because the world tú lives yo, in disgrace. Tú y yo but you and I, la we walk in grace. Por eso mi esposa me miró. And that's why my wife looks at me. Porque la gracia estaba sobre mí. Because the grace is over me. <laughs> ah, tremendo. Tremendous. Me encanta el mensaje de los I love the message of the mire, prophet. Mire, para, para que usted lo entienda. Okay, so listen, listen well so we yo, can finish up. Yo tengo up. una hija. I have a daughter. Y mi hija es mi vida. And my daughter's my life. Mi hija es mi amor. She's my love. Yo, yo me molesto con mi hija. Uh, I always bother her. Lo que te prometí, no te lo voy a dar. And, and or she always bothers me, and so I'll say, oh, what I promised you, I'm not going to give you. No te lo mereces. You don't deserve it. Estás castigada. You're, you're being punished. Cuando pasan 15 minutos, 20 and minutos. And then 15, 20 minutes later. Mi hija llega. My daughter will come. Y me da un besito. And she'll give me a little kiss. Papá, ¿cómo está? And she'll say, Daddy, how are you? Pipo, ¿cómo te sientes? How are you feeling? <laughs> ya hay mi corazón. And then my heart. <laughs> y ahí le digo. And then I say to her. Lo que te dijo ahorita. And what I just said to you. Ya no es. It's not that way anymore. Toma lo que te dije. Take whatever you want. <laughs> Así es Dios. 
That's how God is with nosotros us. Somos sus hijos. We're his children. Y él nos, él, él pone cosas en and, he, and he gives us things que no that we don't deserve. Y aún sin and even though we don't deserve them, él la pone en he places them in our hands. Él envió a he, he sent us Jesus. Si even though we didn't deserve him. Dice Romanos 5, 8. And that's what uh, Romans 5.8 says. Ma, ma Dios muestra su amor para con nosotros. That, that God showed his love for us. En que siendo aún pecadores, and that while we were still sinners, Christ por nosotros. died for us. Dice que esa gracia, aquí lo dice, la gracia, and this says the grace estaba destinada a nosotros. It was reserved for us. Cristo vino destinado para nosotros. Jesus was destined for la us. Palabra destinado the word destined para un means fin. that it was signaled for an end la or a purpose. The word destined lugar o means a, a place or an fin. establishment where something will be completed. De tal que viene. And so in that way Jesus came ¿Para qué viene? or is coming and why is he coming? Para morir por and he came to die for en la cruz del Calvario. us in the cross of Calvary de su sangre preciosa uh, and, and, and through his precious blood tú y yo tener el you perdón de nuestro pecado the forgiveness of our sins sabe usted do you know que la sangre de Cristo that the blood of Jesus por medio de ella through it usted y yo you and I tres beneficios we receive three benefits la sangre de Cristo the, the blood of Jesus nos beneficia benefits us en nuestro pasado in our past en nuestro presente in our present y en nuestro futuro and in our future dice Dice Efesios capítulo 1 versículo 7. In Ephesians 1, 7 it says que por la sangre de Cristo, that by the blood of Jesus, usted y yo, you and I obtenemos el perdón de nuestros pecados. Have the forgiveness of sins. Quiere decir que lo que hicimos en el pasado, and that means that it, it, it happened in the past, ya quedó borrado. It's already erased. Por la sangre de Cristo, by the blood of Jesus. Y aunque el diablo te lo recuerde, and even though the devil remembers it, ya Cristo te perdonó. Jesus forgets it and he forgives it for the present. Pero en el presente, But in the present, dice primero de Juan, the first of John says, uno siete, y por la sangre de Cristo, that by the blood of Jesus in 1 John 1, 7, we have the forgiveness of our sins. Que si pecamos en el presente, and so if we forgive, if we sin in the present, y pedimos perdón, and we ask forgiveness, la sangre de Cristo the blood limpia, of Jesus pero cleans para, us. Pero para un futuro, and then also for the future, dice en Romanos 5, 9, Ro Romans 5, 9 que ya says estamos justificados that we are already justified por medio de la sangre de Cristo, by the blood of Jesus. Decir and that means que el mensaje de los profetas, that the message of the prophet is, is a true message es el and it's the greatest que message puede ser that can be pre preached to bueno, humanity. Viene una gracia. People, a grace is coming Desde Adán. Since, since Adam Hasta el día de hoy, until the day of today se está este mensaje, and we're going to continue this message the salvación. message is a, a message of salvation por eso, por eso Juan dice, and that's why John 3.16 says de tal manera, that for God so loved the world de tal me encanta, de tal, de tal, de tal me so, so esta palabra de tal me encanta porque una palabra de tal no this tiene word, limite, so it doesn't tal, have limits no tiene this espacio, word de doesn't tal, have Space. The word so is a word that goes beyond. The word so goes beyond the destiny of humanity. The word so, it's like a transcendental word. It transcends time. It transcends the past and the present. For God so loved the world that he gave his only son that whoever believes in him will not perish but have have eternal Hallelujah. life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Ya terminamos. Ya, sí. ya. 30 minutos y ya terminamos. Okay, in 30 minutes we'll finish now. <laughs> One minute. One minute. One minute. more minute. Uh -huh. One minute. Perfecto. One minute. One minute. Jesucristo. Jesus Christ. Es el Señor. Is the Lord. Y Jesucristo viene pronto. And pronto. Jesus Christ is coming Jesucristo. soon. Jesucristo. Jesus Christ. Él tiene que ser el mensaje. That has to be the message. He Cent has to be the message. Central de la iglesia. The central hoy message en la tierra. of the church today el in the earth. El mensaje principal. The message. The principal message that has to be boca. on your lips Jesucristo. and on my lips is that Jesus Christ. Termino diciendo. I'm gonna. Jesu I'm gonna finish saying. Jesucristo. Jesus Christ. Es la plenitud is the fulfillment of the grace of God. Jesus 
completo. Jesus Christ es la revelación perfecta is the perfect revelation de Dios al hombre. of God to humankind. Je Jesucristo Jesus Christ dio cumplimiento is the fulfillment al plan redentor of the, of, of the redemptive plan que Dios tenía para la humanidad. that God has for humanity. Jesucristo Jesus Christ es el original. is the original y los demás son copias. and the rest of us are copies. Donald Trump va a morir. Donald Biden Trump's va a morir. And, and Biden are going to die. Clinton va a morir. Fidel Castro murió. Uh, Fidel Castro already, already died. Jose Martí este died. All the people of this Pero earth are Jesus going Cristo to die. But Jesus no Christ muerto. is not Él dead. He is alive. And he remains. Es he is forever. El va a pasar. El Socialism is going to pass El away. And capitalism is going to pass away. And the Mercedes Benz is going to pass away. But Jesus Christ is never going to pass away. He will remain forever. He will endure forever. He is eternal. He is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Amen. 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 Qué lindo. Sí, qué lindo. I love you. I love you most. I love you. Thank you. I love you. Jesus Christ. Viva Christ. Viva Christ. Long live Jesus. Qué lindo. Sí, qué lindo. Thank you, Pastor. Thank you. I love you. Sí, qué lindo.